Hoosier Nation. Folks the Dom checking in from Bloomington. I just want to let Indiana know I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Indiana, we here. All right, gentlemen, we are back with another episode of Retro Bowl College. Now, as the new head coach of the Indiana Hoosiers, I want to start out this episode by not only giving a speech to the players, but also a speech to the staff, to the school, to the student section. Now, college football is like Pokemon. I grew up watching Pokemon. I played all the Pokemon games on the DS. I played Pokemon Go. I didn't touch grass. And gentlemen, if you watch the show in Pokemon, there's a very famous catchphrase by the main character, Ash Ketchum. When he was first blessed with the Pokedex by Professor Rowe, he positively exclaimed to the world that he was going to catch them all. Now listen, fellas, all right? Tavai, heck, Moreau. Some of you guys are complacent with life. And all I want to say is, as the new head coach of the Indiana Hoosiers, I got to recruit them all. If you don't want to play for the program, that's fine. We'll send you over to that port. Ain't no problem with that. But I'm going into houses. I'm going out of high school games. I'm doing background checks on all these high school kids, not only across America, but in Asia as well. So without further ado, I actually don't know what's going to happen in this episode. I don't know how the game works. I haven't seen anyone else play, but I know my boy Gary McDonald is about to graduate. This man is about to declare for the NFL draft. And you know what, man? He fully deserves it. He put up 326, six touchdowns, 17 receptions. Oh my God. Let's just press continue and find out, I guess. Okay, what's going on? Big 10 championship is Iowa, Michigan. All right, there's six pages of bowl games. Wow, okay. Atlantic championship, that's the ACC. SEC championship is Georgia, LSU. Okay, Alabama didn't make it. Nick Saban, maybe I take Nick Saban's job. I don't Oh, wow. Okay. LSU wins the national championship. They beat Georgia 33 to 15. Brian Kelly, that fake Southern accent, wins against Kirby Smart 33 to 15. Let's first continue here. We did not play in a single bowl game in our year one team. That is going to change very, very soon here. It's just a side note here. I just want to check. Is, is my YouTube channel still on this game? Oh! Oh, still on the game. Okay, okay. All right, you can go check out my videos right there. All right, there you go. I'm happy about that. Let's first continue here. The college football season is over, and your senior and junior star players are preparing to declare for the pro draft. Oh, scare me, bro. You gotta stay one more year, man. You gotta stay one more year. Wait, what happens now? Pro draft, draft eligible players. Okay, let me take a look. Tevin Downs is draft eligible, bro. You cannot go, Tevin. Tevin, bro, you need one more year of reps. All right, you're kind of slow. You haven't spent enough time in the film room. If you declare for the draft, you're gonna go undrafted, and you're gonna end up in the CFL. All right, Tevin, you gotta stay. Keenum, you gotta pick another career. Football is not for you. Go go do some science. Go hop in a lab. Football is not for you. Jeremy, man, I mean, I can't do anything about this. He's about to shine in the NFL, man. Go be great, man. Go represent who's your nation. New donations, zero dollars. Nobody donated. I don't have NIL money? Are you kidding me? Where's my alumni? Where are the boosters? Where? What? What's going on here? How am I supposed to turn over the program without any NIL money, man? Okay, Downs is not declaring. Okay, he's staying. He's staying for his senior year. I don't know why I'm so excited. He's not even that good. All right, but Tevin Downs is staying. I like that. Oh, they go one by one here. Okay. Keenum did not get drafted. 10000 for the scholarship fund. Okay, that, that's what I was telling you. Get in that lab, man. Go, go find the new vaccine. You know what I'm saying? Go find that fifth booster. Jeremy Donald, he entered the draft and was signed by Seattle. <laughs> Third round pick, hey man, Jeremy, go be great, man, go be great. I can't wait to see you in the NFL, you know what I'm saying? Maybe one day Hefe Yaman picks him up in a trade, but he enters the draft and gets signed by Seattle. I get 30,000 for my scholarship fund. All right, it's not enough money though, man. Let's press continue here. I wonder what happens next. Here we go, here we go, here we go. New season begins. Top of many donations from your graduating players you have received, but further 10,000 from the annual alumni endowments program to help you recruit new star players within this year's freshman class. I'm recruiting. This is what I'm talking about. Let's press continue all right a brand new season my first official year here in indiana only six out of ten players i don't know what's going on here i put 12 man roster i think i think this might be a glitch but i think we're good to go here freshman admissions i wonder what this screen is man let me show 
the new recruits. It's time for college admissions. You can spend the institution's football scholarship fund to recruit new freshman athletes to replace any key players who have left at the end of the previous year. All right, we're, we're, we're recruiting. Choose wisely. You will need to scout players in order to review more details about them. And each time you recruit a new athlete, the number of remaining prospects will be reduced. Once the draft is over, you will not be able to choose any more new players until the start of next year's new season. What? I can't have them visiting the school? Come on, man. That's my advantage. We're gonna show them the Indiana crowd. You know, the Indy 500. Peyton Manning, he's gonna be there. You know what I'm saying? That's the whole point of this, man. I gotta have them on visits. I can't have them visit my school anymore. All right, okay, I guess so. This is it right here. This is this is, this is is our team. Remember that scholarship fund does not work like a pro football salary cap. You can only spend what you have already earned and once it's gone, it's gone. What if Chick-fil-A comes through and, and says that I can give two NIL deals to new freshmen? You know what I'm saying? Like, well, what about that? I can't hit the portal either? There's no portal? There's gotta be a portal. There's gotta be a transfer portal. You can fill up the scholarship fund via new donations when your senior players declare for the pro draft and via various other college events. I just did not pronounce various there. The fund has an upper limit, but you can raise the limit in athletics office using your coaching credits. All right, all right, okay. So this is very similar to Reshable. We have to use our scholarship fund right now is what I'm hearing. Okay, let's press continue. You know, more reading. If you need to cut existing players from the team, you can do so via the roster screen by selecting a player and choosing revoke scholarship. Ooh, I can take that away from Cutting a player now during the admissions draft will put some money back into the scholarship fund, but cutting a player at any other time in the season will not. Interesting. So if I gotta cut him out, I gotta cut him now. You will always earn more money for the scholarship fund by keeping a player in the roster until he graduates as a senior compared to revoking a scholarship early. Okay, so it's better if I keep the player and let him graduate because I get more money that way. But if I do want any more money right now i have to revoke scholarships now all right let's, let's whoa 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 these guys all want to play for indiana okay all right, all right, that's my boy seymour you know what i'm saying i was at his house last thanksgiving you know what i mean we were having some mashed potatoes with cranberry sauce you know what I'm saying? hey seymour what's good my boy jokes too see me and jokes actually go way back i used to coach him in peewee football you know what i'm saying jokes comes back he's loyal to the ball these are the guys that want to come play for indiana all right no five-star recruits though we're still a small school you know Vitas and Gu. Running back, he's from Serbia. Trust me, I went out there and I recruited him. Hevzadon covers Europe too, you know what I'm saying? Good strength, good speed. That's from wrestling with the Bears, you know what I mean? That's his backstory. He used to actually wrestle with the Bears. Vitas and Gu. Very, very interesting. Let me take a look at my roster here. Wow, we need a lot. Okay, uh, yeah, we, we need pretty much every position, if we're honest. Hold on, what happens if I revoke his scholarship? You want to cut Tevin down. He will permanently be removed, but 6,000 will be added into the scholarship fund. Hmm. Okay, what about Moreau? How much? 3,000? All right. Goff? 2,000. No, I want to keep Goff. Morgan Goff. He's got potential. He's got he's got a chance to make the league. He's only a sophomore. We draft a new quarterback. Oh my God. Bashad Edelman. Man, look at that throw accuracy. He's going to use up all my money though, man. We got to spread it out. All right, we definitely need a wide receiver. That That's for sure. We currently do not have a receiver on this team. I'm looking at that boy, Stefan Bucks. You know, Stefan... He's got Tyreek Hill speed. He could run out the gates, you know? But the problem with Stefan Buck is that he's got competition, all right? Roderick Gordon. He's special. You know, in high school, when I went to go see Roderick play, I went to go see him run track as well. You know, he was actually the best 800 meter runner in the state. Roderick Gordon, he gonna cost me 24K. I only have 51,000, man. We're broke here at Indiana. I do like Edelman though, man. Damn, bro. All right, but you know what? Hefsa Dong's first career recruit has to be a splash play and i've determined we need a new signal caller and ladies and gentlemen i'm bringing my luggage with me and it's louis half zadon's first ever recruitment in the college reservoir series to rebuild indiana to rebuild this program is none other than well the Chinese man, all right? He is going to be our new quarterback. He's actually half Chinese, half white, hence the last name, Wells. You know, the funny story about Wells is when he was eight years old, I went out to a camp in Beijing and I saw him spin that thing. And he was spinning that thing. And I said, who's that kid over there? We gotta get him to America. And ever since then, man, Darwin, we've kept in contact. I'm the reason why he's in America. Darwin Wells, we don't press scout player on this channel. We don't do none of that. That's some weak stuff right there. That's too easy. You know what I'm saying? That's what Kirby Smart be doing. We don't do none of that, all right? We just recruit and we see how the player is after, all right? Darwin Wells, our first recruitment in the Retrable College Series. Let's see what type of stuff he's got. Four star potential. Okay, he's got room for arm strength improvement. We'll take He is going to be the quarterback of Indiana. He's about to get all the hoes. It's about to be insane, man. Darwin Wells is in the building, and that means we're sending. 
That boy Tevin Downs. You're headed to the portal, buddy. Get, get, get in the portal. We'll see you later, all right? The luggage is Louis. Now we're gonna need some more scholarship funds. So we're gonna have to send more of these players to the portal. Otomiwo, you're too busy partying. Portal. Juju Moreau, epistemology. Yeah, portal. Tavai, studying space sciences. Portal, all right? This team went four and five last year in the conference. Four and eight overall, okay? We're not having any of this stuff right here. Kenyon Heck, one star player. What am I supposed to be doing with that? Portal! The only man we're keeping on this team is Morgan Goff, all right? Now we only got two out of 10 players. Wait, we don't have a roster now. All right, let's go back. Remember that other colleges will be making admission offers to some of the candidates. Each time you recruit a new athlete, the number of remaining prospects will be deduced. Okay. Okay, so now this is interesting. We can either sign one big time player or we split it into two mediocre players. But listen, man, we need a target for Darwin Wells, all right? We need a guy who can catch that rock. We gotta get them track athletes. We need a wide receiver. For me, it's between Steph Bugs and Rod Gordon. And you notice how I shortened their first names there? Because I know them both on a personal basis. I love these young men right here, man. These young men, they have character. They live, they breathe, they bleed football. And that's what I like. Those are the characters that I need. I need players that are fast. Repeat after me. Fast, fast tough, tough, smart, smart disciplined. Discipline. Discipline. You know what, with our second recruit, we are going to go get Steph Box onto the squad. That max speed, that's teasing me. I need that type of speed at Indiana. That's 4-2-5 speed right there. We're gonna work on this catching. You know what I mean? The wide receiver staff, we, we gonna get him on the jugs. Michael Jackson gonna get his technique right. Matter of fact, Michael Jackson was the one who scouted his staff bug. Recruit him right there. Yes, sir. Welcome to Indiana. Please be a game changer. Please be a game changer. Please be a game changer. Three maps on potential. I fumbled. <laughs> <laughs> MJ! MJ, man, come on, man. Oh my god, I fumbled, man. But you know what? Hey, he's our new receiver, anyways. He's gonna stretch the field. Steph Bugs, welcome to the squad. I was hoping he'd be a four and a half star, man. Now we can't sign any of these guys. All right, the only player we can sign is Dix. And I think I'd rather keep my scholarship fund. So, you know what? We're just gonna press continue here. To finish the admissions process. You will not be able to choose new players for the team until the season is complete for the next year's admissions begin. If you recruited all the freshman players that you need, you can continue. Wait, what about the portal? I literally dismantled the roster assuming that there's a transfer portal. There's no transfer portal. Then I am absolutely screwed in my first year as Indiana head coach. We're gonna have a whole lot of walk-ons. All right, let's first continue here. Please be a portal, man. The freshman players have arrived at college and the season can begin. Welcome. Let's press continue here. Is there no portal? There's no portal? No. Nah. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. nah, 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 what do you mean? I, I can't, I can't, I, there's no, there's no chance in portal. <laughs> I gotta play the whole season with three players. <laughs> oh, oh, I fumbled. Oh. Let's first continue. You can now choose a player to return kickoffs. Oh my God, don't give me that. Okay, you know what though? This is the start of the rebuild. This is what was needed. You know what I mean? We had to get rid of all that garbage. We only have three players on the squad. But this is part of the process, ladies and gentlemen. This is part of the pain that we must endure as the Indiana head coach. It's gonna be a bad team this year. It's gonna be a really bad team this year. We don't even have a junior on the team. We, we have no veteran leadership. We got Michael Jackson as our offensive coordinator. We, we don't have a good team. But listen, it's a process, it's a grind. We're gonna get to the top eventually. I need help from you guys, all right? Let me know what I should be doing in the comments down below. I don't think there's a way to sim either. Yeah, we gotta play this year. We gotta play with three players. We gotta play with walk-ons. All right, this is not a good start to this series. I just put myself in a hole. As if putting myself in Indiana wasn't a deeper hole, I put myself in a deeper one. Oh my God. All right, you never know. It's Hefzadam. We might be able to pull off miracles. Let's see what happens next time when we start the season against me.